Let's rot in bed together. Yay! Let's rot. But here we are fucking cleaning. Is the rotting in the room with us? I look like a snowman. It's only in a matter of time because we got food, we got food, we got food. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so Okay, let me just shut the fuck up. If you're rotting, come rot with me. Welcome back to my channel. Guys, it's my favorite time of the month. What? It's my favorite time of the month. It is time to freaking rot in bed. <laughs> I love these days. I need today to rot. I'm just so hungry right now. I'm exhausted. I'm tired. I just need to rot in bed and do nothing and worry about nothing. So today I'm going to do my rotting in bed night routine because you guys seen a bunch of my night routines, morning routines, yada, 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 but you've never seen me rot in bed. And little disclaimer, if you're trying to be productive today, do not watch this video because you will probably just want to rot in bed. So let's rot in bed together. Yay! <laughs> but before rotting, I don't know why. I'm the type of person I cannot rot if I know there's responsibilities that I have to do. And guess what? Your girl has responsibilities to do. I have a little checklist to do before rotting in bed. It is around like 7 p.m. I'm exhausted. I'm so tired. I came home last night from my friend's house at 5 freaking a.m. and I slept so late and I woke up at 10. I had like four hours of sleep. Sorry, I'm sidetracking, but I had to meet a friend today. It was so much fun, but I was so tired. I just came back. Now I have to deal with all my responsibilities and then we can rot. Yeah, 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 Let's do a little checklist of the things I have to do before I have to rot. Ready? Boom, checklist. First, I'm gonna order my dinner. Second, I have some paperwork to do because if you didn't know, I am moving out of this apartment, which is my sister's, and I'm trying to get a place in New York City. It's been a long process. You guys will get content of it soon, but I have to do a bunch of paperwork for it. Then I need to clean because this apartment is so messy and my room is even messier. I can only rot if I'm in like a good mindset. So therefore we will clean. So let's freaking get started. I'm so excited to move out and have my own space. I'm just so excited to share a new chapter with you guys, but goddamn, it is not easy renting a place in New York City, nor is it cheap. So, your girl has been stressing over the past few days with all these paperwork, like, oh my adulting. Oh my adulting is so real. Also, look at this cute, cutie little bag. I carry this bag freaking everywhere, like freaking to school, to meet up with friends. If it's so much stuff, it's such a cute tote bag. This is not sponsored, but it's by a Korean brand called Samo Ando. Really cute. I'm so hungry, it's not even funny, funny at all. Okay, I'm thinking Indian food. Oh, Indian food is just so good. It's so good. It's just so good. It's so good. I need to get Indian food. I also have homework to do, but it's not due until like later this week, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Why do we need to worry about things due in the future? I don't care. I don't care. When you're rotting, you don't cook. It's your day off. You don't do sh it, all right? Even though I'm literally doing work right now, but okay. I'm gonna order some chicken tikka masala. Chicken tikka masala and some garlic naan. F yes, put it in my tummy right now and let me gobble it, swallow it, drip down inside of me. Should I get a mango lassi? Fuck it. Freak, freak it, okay? I don't care. I'm gonna get a freaking mango lassi if I want to. Yeah, what are you gonna do about it? Absolutely freaking nothing, man. Period, period, period. I toured so many apartments in New York. It's freaking crazy. <sighs> I'm so hungry, I can't talk. But I think I found the one. I just need to get approved for this apartment and I'm good to go. I'm so excited to show you guys this apartment. It's probably nothing like you guys are imagining, nothing. 
nothing. Renting New York is no joke. There's so much, so many things to do about it. Like one would think you just need to pay rent and that's it, but you need to show so many documents. In New York, it's a law to get apartment insurance. I don't know if like, if that's a thing in other states, but I need to get apartment insurance. I need to get so much, so much, so just so much freaking stuff. Like a broker's fee, utilities, freaking heat and water, like, why? I'm so hungry, I'm gonna faint. I don't know, for some reason, I need to do all my work before rotting so I can be in peace or else I'll feel really guilty rotting. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, I think I am done with that. I am so hungry, I feel like there's a pit in my stomach, but I'm gonna quickly clean up this house because I've been just like leaving everywhere and i feel like i need to kind of organize you know so let's organize a little bit the state of your room represents your mind therefore you must clean it up a bit you know okay let's do the kitchen first my friend gave me these sun cakes from taiwan i'm so excited to try this You guys would be shocked. This whole box is a box of products that Evelyn wants to do for a giveaway. A lot of companies send us like the same products. So when we get duplicates of things, we just put in the box so we can gift it to you guys. Let's quickly do the dishes. Did I wear this wrong? It's two gloves are the same size. Same, same side. It's backwards, but whatever. Asian people get it, Asian gloves. Kitchen smells so much better. And now my sink smells like lemons. Okay, now that kitchen is done, let's move on to the living room. It's not too messy. I just have to put away some of my freaking clothes. This is the mess I'm talking about. It's just this chair. This is from Sunday School. I love their fleece jackets. It's so cute and funky. I recently got this um, suede brown jacket from Zara. So cute, I love it. Okay, I'm having like OCD moments because now that I started cleaning, I wanna like clean this entire apartment, but I'm like too hungry to do that. Okay, let's look at the state of my freaking room, you guys. Don't be scared, okay? I'm a clean person. Clothes just end up on my floor without me intentionally meaning it. It looks worse in person because it's just like a big pile in the middle of my room. Okay, let's organize this. Okay, I'm gonna do bare minimum cleaning because your girl is freaking tired, man. This isn't a deep clean video. This isn't a productive video, okay? It's supposed to be rotting, so I don't, I'm just gonna do bare minimum cleaning and then call it a day, just so my mind is a bit more clear. So interesting how the human mind works. Let's rot, but here we are freaking cleaning. Like, okay, rotting. Is the rotting in the room with us? Clearly freaking not, it looks like I'm unrotting. Don't worry, I'm gonna rot in a few seconds. Comment down below if you want me to do a deep clean video because my room is just so overcrowded with products. I need to, why am I sniffing my clothes? I was just checking if I needed to laundry it. Maybe I'll laundry this. Comment down below if you wash your clothes after one use. For pants, I wear them, wear my pants at least like five times and then I wash them because I don't think jeans you need to wash every time. And then for tops, I only wash them maybe like twice. If I sweat a lot in them, I'll laundry it, but I don't think I really need to laundry my shirts unless I went out in them for like a day. I mean, like a half the day. Look at that, and you can see the floor. Okay, laundry is this. Dun, 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 dun. Here's my lovely little closet. Let's put all of our stuff in here. Oh my god, I just realized I have a pile of clothes. 
on my bed. Are you kidding me? Oh. Sometimes I just wanna like throw away all my clothes and just start new because why do I have so many clothes? We're almost done. We can rot very soon. I'm gonna quickly vacuum. I don't need to, but my OCD right now is telling me I need to vacuum or else I'm gonna be in a dusty room rotting. We're gonna vacuum, okay? I'm on my last battery to do this. I just need to, I just, I just need to vacuum and then I'm gonna eat. We just cleaned and now we can eat food. Yes. But I think I wanna eat food while I'm in my clothes. So I'm gonna quickly wash my body, brush my teeth, do my skincare, and then eat. This is my thought process of rotting, you guys. You guys are really getting that night routine specialty because this is what goes through my mind before I need to rot. I need to be in comfy clothes, clean vibes, and then I can rot peacefully. Okay, let's take our makeup off. Makeup off. I'm breaking out recently so much. I don't know why. I don't know why. Okay, period. <sighs> Wee! Okay, I'm gonna take a quick body shower because I washed my hair this morning actually. I'm so smart for that. Yeah, let's let's freaking shower, man. Let's shower. Oh, oh, oh. Let me know what temperature you shower in because I shower in scorching hot water. I know it's not good for me, but guys, look at my skin. What the hell? What the hell is going on? Everyone needs this in their shower. It's a towel scrub, but it exfoliates your body when you wash your body. Game changing and gets rid of all those dead skin cells and all the sweat and the gunk. Quite nice actually. And it's way more effective than a loofah. I never liked loofahs. And the best thing is, it reaches your back. I look like a snowman, sweet. I look like I have a white shirt on. Today it's giving turtleneck fall cozy September. This is the new Miu Miu collection. It's called Foam Shirt. Okay, let me shut up and wash this off. I literally showered this morning, but I feel gross because I got so little sleep and I just like feel gross today. I feel gross, I need a raw and like feel even more gross. And then tomorrow will be a new day. Wash it off, it's like a metaphor. Every time I close your eyes, you feel so much like a All right, we good. Hello, I have body showered and it's time to just lotion up, put some PJs on, freaking eat food, man. Philosophy just sent me lotion and I'm so excited to try it. I feel like it'll smell really good. Okay, let's try this lotion out. Oh. I could lick this lotion. It smells so good. Oh, heck yeah, man. Freak yeah. I'm all about smelling good. Thanks. She a little hairy. Oh, my towel's coming off. My towel coming off. My towel's coming off. I'm in my PJs. Hell freak yeah. Gonna put on a hoodie. Cause I'm feeling like a cozy hoodie vibe. Oh. You're not even ready. You are not even ready. Okay, I changed into a tank top so I can just wear a hoodie over. This is my favorite hoodie for rotting. Oh, I got this in like a size like large or something at a SZA concert. Look at the way it fits. Freaking amazing. Okay, we're gonna quickly do some skincare. Quickly do some skincare. Quickly do some skincare. This is my skin, you guys. It's not looking too good. I think it's from stress or maybe from my diet because I've been eating like freaking shit. I think lashes are growing on me. I don't know. I'm still deciding if I like them or not because it's a hit or miss every time I get them done. Lokia missed this time. I'm so hungry. I don't even want to freaking use this. Okay, we're gonna use this toner pad. If you don't pick up, I'm actually gonna throw you out the window. There we go. We're just gonna use one. We're not trying to get fancy here. We're just trying to rock. Oh my god, the texture on my skin is getting really bad. Like, if I graze my hands against my cheeks, it feels like a reptile skin, and I don't like it. Period! 
Okay, let's freaking eat, you guys. The frick? What am I doing right now? I feel like I'm in like a time crunch because it's only an amount of time because it's only a matter of time until my body shuts down because I'm so hungry. So let's eat. We got food, we got food, we got food. Let's freaking eat this. Okay, I know I'm really stalling, but I really have been liking this tea brand or this wellness brand. It's called By Ava. My friend is actually the founder of it, but I'm not being biased. It tastes so good and it has like a lot of collagen and it helps like for your, it helps your skin basically. And I've been eating it like every single day. So I'm gonna quickly heat it up. Okay, let's eat. Let's just eat. I just want to eat, please. Plate. I love that they gave me a plate so I don't have to do dishes. My garlic naan. Wait, what? Oh my god, mango lassi. <gasps> Break my water. I'm drinking mango lassi. Rice. Oh. I've literally never been so happy in my life. Um, I'm ditching my hoodie because this is time for business. I feel like a mukbanger, bruh. Okay, let's try the mango lassi. Oh my god, it came in like a little can. How cute. I do like it cold, but I'm too impatient. I'm just gonna drink it. <gasps> I'm so excited. Wow. The mango in this, so ripe. I just know I'm gonna have the best sleep of my life because of this. This is the elite setup right now. Elite lineup, period. And they gave me utensils, so I don't have to do the dishes. Look at this garlic naan. <laughs> I'm gonna f***ing cry. I'm gonna f***ing cry. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna actually start crying. Oh my god, I just know this bite is gonna be heavenly. Just, oh my god, oh my god. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so Okay, let me just shut the f*** up. I think this is the best delivery I've ever had. I order from the same place every single time, but this hits so good today. Oh my freaking frick. I'm so happy. This is everything and all I need in life. Something about this man is just so breathtaking. Wait, I want to just eat all three in one bite. Okay, that's not possible. Well, yes, this is the life. The sauce is just so good. I'm out of words. I want to get a pound of chicken tikka masala and shove it in my face until I cannot breathe. By the way, you guys, I rotted literally last weekend. That's why this rot is like less of a rot vibe because I already rotted last week. Last week's rot was pretty, pretty intense. I didn't even clean anything. I just laid in bed because I felt like shit and I couldn't do anything. I couldn't move. So I just rotted in bed. This week, it's like half rotting because I cleaned. And like, I feel like when you're rotting, you really should not be doing anything and just allowing yourself to relax but I can't rot in a stressful mindset, therefore I clean. I'm not usually like a clean freak, you guys. I'm gonna watch my K-drama. I'm currently watching Love Next Door. It's a new K-drama on Netflix. Pretty freaking fire. I wish I had a guy best friend that lived next door and then I actually really fell in love with him. That would be kind of epic. I'm gonna watch this show and eat. Man, this was good. I have like three pieces of chicken left. I'm gonna save that for light tie if I ever crave it. That was so good and I'm in the fattest food coma now. Like that was actually such a good meal. I'm so happy. Straight fire. I'm now in bed. I feel like shit. Like literal doo-doo. Guys, I'm so influencer. I got this light. Influencer light. This apartment at night is so dark. Like this is my room without any light okay it's not it's not terrible but this helps i'm in bed now and this feels amazing i love my bed like genuinely okay i rot pretty often and i'm kind of terrified it's like a symptom of like some kind of burnout because i don't know maybe it's a problem or maybe it's a universal thing but sometimes i freak out because i like 
severely love rotting in bed. My only wish sometimes is to stay in bed and rot for days on days on days and days and days and days and days and, days and, days and not deal with any of my responsibilities. Just sit in my bed, endlessly watching K-dramas in my thoughts. Like I don't even want to leave my room. That's the type of rotting I usually do. Today has been like kind of a productive rot, but to be honest, my rot just started. It's starting now, you know, like that was my pre-rot. I honestly don't know what I'm saying. I'm so tired. I'm just so tired. Also, my life has been just so boring and I mean low-key I love that it's boring because now I have so much time to focus on myself But that's also the problem. I don't want to be like thinking so much because lately I've been thinking a lot about myself so much it's like kind of it's like so annoying you know i'm like can i just stop thinking about myself like i wish i just had a distraction in my life so i don't have to think about it but i mean i, don't f I honestly feel like i'm my own therapist if i talk to myself for long enough i can solve my entire issue okay like i will do it right now ready go i love riding in bed because i could just do nothing and sit here with no responsibilities why do you feel like that um well i feel like i feel like this because i'm inching towards a burnout because i kind of feel like i have a lot of responsibilities but then throughout my day i kind of gaslight myself saying that other people have way more responsibilities than me and i'm just a pussy so i just deal with it and do all my responsibilities without really resting throughout the week okay um that doesn't sound very healthy but i don't know if, if what's healthy or not so i think it's pretty efficient um but then when i rot too much then i think about myself you know thinking about myself too much makes me a little anxious and overthink about everything well i feel like that's kind of normal and i feel like everyone goes through that so loki you're chilling wait pff, you're so right i'm literally chilling there my conclusion of that was that i'm chilling sorry i'm yapping if you don't want to hear me yap you could literally click out but i read something online that i feel like 50 percent of you guys can relate when i go to sleep i have to have at least an hour or two in bed so i can scroll my phone and catch up on my social media and that's the time of the day when i feel like i'm winding down and relaxing and having the time to myself like i watch youtube videos i catch up on my um, K-drama episodes, yada, yada, yada. But I read online that the reason we feel like we have to have like an hour or two time period before bed to relax is actually because some other psychological reasoning that I completely forgot what the reasoning was. Let me actually search it up. Over half of Americans spend time on their phones with an hour of going to sleep. I told y'all 50% of you guys can at least relate. I just found my reasoning. I just found it. I just cracked the hack. I just cracked the code. From a psychology site, don't know if it's super credible. Take whatever I'm saying with a grain of salt. But it says, doom scrolling is a specific form of bedtime procrastination where people mindlessly scroll through social media to typically out of boredom, a need to pro procrastinate, or even just to distract themselves from other stressors in life. That is exactly how I feel, I feel like. I scroll and watch K-dramas endlessly for like an hour or two before bed because it literally like distracts me and puts me in a different world right before bed and kind of like eases my mind from other factors of my life. Crack the code. Boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. Cracked. Call me up fbi agent because i just cracked my own brain not to like keep yapping but what i've been realizing a lot a lot a lot this kind of goes hand in hand with my comment where i said that i've been thinking a lot about myself i realized being single is such a necessity in life because you just like learn so much about yourself which is so weird because you are you how can you learn so much like how it's weird that someone doesn't know themselves when you're literally yourself every day you can find new things about yourself and i feel like being in a relationship kind of hinders that that's why people in relationships when they break up they're like i need to break up with you to work on myself and a lot of people will be like you could just work on yourself while being with me like do you not like me work on yourself while being with me X, you're wrong girl or boy you're wrong and i didn't realize that until literally the past few months i feel like my 20s right now i mean i'm only i'm only 20 it hasn't even been a year since i've been 20 but damn i'm already like finding so many things about myself imagine once i turn 22 how many things i will be going through my head hurts thinking about that i need a rod Now I'm gonna watch some K-drama. The best part about rotting is that no responsibilities. If you're rotting, come rot with me. Ugh, K-dramas 
are just so cute. It makes me literally feel so single. I'm so tired. Okay, guys. It is like 11 p.m. And it is time for me to go to sleep. I look like a mess. I feel like a mess. I hope you guys rot in bed. Enjoy your day off. And I will too. And I'm gonna have the best sleep of my life. Thanks for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.